doesn't know for certain that he's behind against One, right. Jamie Peacock in right. the first place. You're absolutely if right. Matt Dawson didn't look particularly Four, happy about calling. Five, if Matt Dawson had six, any type seven, of hand, he'd be going all in rather 100. than just calling. I'll go all in. Wow! <laughs> what a move. What a play what a by move. Brad Drew. <laughs> Matt Dawson. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's gung ho poker. Yeah. I'm just going to sort um, this pot out. Now, just so we, we have it clear time. here, I got anything, but it'll be a good giggle. There's a 1500 oh. pound side pot, I believe, between Brad Drew and Matt Dawson. Peacock's only playing for the main pot, which is pretty sturdy as well. About 1800 worth. Is everyone in the Kings of Aces, James. Uh, oh, the oh, Ace-6 oh, is oh, not oh, in terrible oh, shape. Oh, oh, oh. I just wanted to get him off. Come on. You wouldn't uh, move. There'll definitely be an 8. Or One thing's for certain, we're going to see five cards. You can have an 8, Jamie. Just Two no players all in. Should Brad Drew so win I'm this? my aces all the time. Oh, yeah. got, show no, show me a bit of Ace love over here. Four will come anyway. Interesting stats. It doesn't look great for Brad Drew, but the side pot, he's a lot bigger a favourite than 17%. He's over 50% favourite in the side pot against Matt Dawson. That's correct. Oh, no more of those. Eights are in first and fours are in second. No more of those things, please. Just an eight. Oh. Rubbish. That. This is going very well for everybody, but <laughs> JP Dawson. I've got a few outs. Well, I think he's got Six. himself to blame at the moment. <laughs> I think he knows that as well. Oh, oh there's a four! It's oh. the double knockout! Oh my god, the table's been decimated! Yeah, yeah, of course. I'll come out with you. Yeah, yeah, come on then. Thanks, mate. Well done, mate. Well played. Sorry, See you out there. Cheers. No, no problem. Wow. Well. Oh, sorry, yeah, cheers. Uh, you lucky thing, you. <laughs> <laughs> We're down to three. Cheers, sir. Cheers, mate. Oh, look at us. We're about a thousand each. He's got four thousand over there. <laughs> Brad Drew for the second year in a row. Torturing. <laughs> that was something, Steve. <laughs> Brad Drew, it was a little scary there for a minute. The four on the river, though. 4,200 pounds worth now. An absolutely fascinating hand. And... Uh, well, Matt Dawson, the early bath, along with Austin Healy, and two questionable decisions. Yeah. I've enjoyed myself, but I'm a bit good to go out and a bit um, a bad beat like that, but poker, in it? Lost a little bit of concentration just trying to get too aggressive, but, you know, enjoyed it, got some good hands. Um, but uh, the important thing is Austin was out first. Well, that's an all-in situation. I fear you're right. A king. Okay, he would have been called. The same situation for Paul. Can he slow play him because they're bigger? Well, possibly. Raised 450. Raised 450 total. Yeah, he's going to try and get some action here. And I mean, I think Paul must be mentally committed for the rest of his stack, right? Yes, he's just trying to get... How much a bite like on the end of the hook. And I think mm. he will do. Yeah, I think Brad Drew's very likely to put him all in with this ace. Just simplify matters. Great. Well, it's it's a bit of a problem. I mean, you know, Drew's got a hand where if he calls here... Uh, he can fold it, yes, he can fold. Yeah. I'll go all in. All in. Yeah. I'll have to call. Call. I think you're winning, mate. No bullet. Don't do it, Drew, don't do it. How much did you say more? Okay. 5.40. Okay. I do think that uh, Robbie Paul has more chance of knocking Brad Drew off top spot than Tom Voice does. And this could be where Brad Drew wins it. This if is he can, interesting. If he can hit an ace. It could be so painful. Maybe in the final. No bullet, no bullet, no bullet. Tell me you had an ace. Tell me you had two aces and you folded them both. I wish I did. But don't do it. There's that king. I'm looking all right at the moment. Shh, shh. <laughs> Anything but the bone, says Robbie Paul. Oh. Tom Voice folded a king. <sighs> no! Not that you hit the river last time, Drew.
anything but a bullet. No bullet, no bullet! <laughs> and, uh, you know, he's, he's, he was patient, he waited for his time, and he's got, he's got 2,000 pounds. He, I think he's been let off the hook to some degree by Tom Voice. <laughs> Tom <laughs> Voice, uh, well, he's in the, he's on the button. Yeah, he's on the button, and this he should be able to do some damage from the button, but he's only got 270 left. Get your back over with me, take your head down. Yeah, and trip up, trip up. He's Keep not going to be scaring anybody. Chip in a chair. <laughs> Tom Voice goes all in. Robbie Paul folds and. Brad Drew calls without looking at his hand. That's that's about the strength of it. The best scenario for Tom Voice is if he goes all in now, and Robbie Robbie Paul goes all in as well, or, or calls, gets a bit more value. All in. All in. Go on, Tom Voice. Uh -oh. Big left or too late? Well, he's got more value in the pot, hasn't he? That's for certain. More money in the pot. Total. I call. Oh, oh, can I? I, I got to go to 300, do I? No. Yeah. Cool. Good. I'll call as well. 270. 270. Okay, gentlemen. Just well, he's got. You know, this will now it's about as good as it gets for Tom Voice here. We'll be on the side. Um, I think it's as good. Is it, is it good? It is, isn't it? Because it's, he's got to hit a queen, hasn't he? He's got to get any money, so. Well, at least he can watch it come Obviously, more cards can hurt him, more players can hurt him. him. You haven't completed the race, so you're okay just to call us. Yeah, I'm, I'm not exactly sure. I think reference. you'd have to be happy that the pot is as big ah, as possible for reference. Tom Voice. I mean, yeah. 810 pounds if he wins. A triple up. Can watch it come in. And I think Drew and no. Paul will just sort of check this down. Sort of. Well, they're not in any... Oh, look at this. Isn't it amazing? Go um, on. It's good shape. Check. Right check. I think he's, he's back in it. It'd be very unfortunate now to lose this. His patience has Check. been rewarded. Check. Another 10 would be upsetting. Well, that would, that would be really cruel. Check, check. It seems like the cards Ten. do like people, don't they, Ten. when they're really down and out. The cards nice. support the Jammed underdog it. sometimes. Oi! <laughs> nice. That's the biggest part times one today. <laughs> I was like that. Hello! <laughs> <laughs> That's not what you wanted, was it, ETL? Oh, hey. you're right, you're right. <laughs> you know, a lot of it is experience. I mean, I think in your match, um, when you were playing against Dennis Taylor, who's obviously got very good card sense and has played a lot of cards, right. but just might not have had right. as much tournament experience. The and there's some situations right. you don't see very often. And look at this, you see? Sure he was waiting for the queens right. and he's got them. All in. Marvelous. I am not. Brad Drew is more or less committed. Okay, gentlemen. Cards, please. Somehow, yes. should these queens hold up, Brad Drew I'm not saying he's let anybody back in the game, it's just slipping away from him. Oh, what a Hasn't Tom Voice done well here? A thousand pounds now he's going to have if the ladies hold. <laughs> Don't say that, now you're giving me it back. Oh. <laughs> the spawniest man in the world. No, no right, you're right. The <laughs> oh, there's F4. Oh. There you go, mate. Pretty hard to get from here. Unbeatable now. Not if two running sevens come, Drew. Oh, yeah. He could pull that out the moment, they can. Here's one. It's all over. He's the union player. Who I was would... actually begging you to go. Not go. Well, you do, but it's going to go in either way, doesn't it? Mm. Just glad you, you had to. Ball. You put 600 in. How much would you have had? I only had it, I don't know. I think oh, I had about four. No, oh, you He's you the best thing that has yeah, happened to rugby union since Argentina. Three, three, four, nine. <laughs> I didn't think you'd come. Two. I just think, God, oh, God, God. Since they went uh, three-handed, actually, uh, Paul and Voice have taken a bit of a nut out of Brad Drew. He's, he's dumped over, oh, I don't know, 1,200 pounds? Yes, he won't be happy. I, I don't think through bad play. I mean, he possibly could have raised a bit more than he did, uh, bullied the players, but... 
ചെയ്യും